What we're watching is one of the strangest visitors to cross our skies in a long time, the object known as 3I Atlas. At first glance it was catalogued as a comet, but the more we watch it, the more it refuses to fit the usual rules. First anomaly, color. As 3I Atlas approached the sun it brightened sharply, then, unexpectedly, it turned a vivid blue, even bluer in some measurements than sunlight itself. That blue flare is not a small curiosity, it points to unusual chemistry or ionization, something the spectrographs are still working to explain. Second anomaly, motion. Precise tracking shows tiny, measurable accelerations that gravity alone doesn't predict. In comets, we usually explain such pulls by outgassing, jets of vapor acting like tiny thrusters. But here the timing and magnitude of the acceleration are unusual, stronger or differently phased than we expect for a normal comet. Third anomaly, appearance. A classic comet near the sun grows a long tail, a trail of dust and gas swept back by sunlight and solar wind. 3I Atlas, by contrast, has displayed directional jets and localized brightening rather than a long, continuous tail. In some images the activity appears to project forward, toward the object's motion, not only behind it. That geometry is difficult to reduce to simple perspective effects. Taken together, these facts form a striking pattern, an unusual blue color, non-gravitational acceleration, lack of a typical tail, and jets with forward orientation. Each anomaly on its own could be explained. All of them together make 3I Atlas a genuine puzzle. So what are the sensible possibilities? The leading natural hypotheses include rare ices or exotic volatiles, CO, CO2, or unusual organic chemistry, highly processed surface layers from long interstellar exposure, or asymmetric sublimation that produces non-standard jet geometries. These models can explain color shifts, brightening, and some acceleration, but none is yet a knockout explanation for every anomaly at once. We must be cautious about sensational conclusions. The idea that 3I Atlas is an artificial craft makes for headlines, but extraordinary claims need extraordinary evidence. Right now, the observational record points more convincingly to an exotic natural object than to anything engineered. Still, and this is important, 3I Atlas is forcing astronomers to revisit assumptions and run new observations. That scientific friction is exactly how breakthroughs happen. We'll keep watching. New spectra, new images, and more precise tracking in the coming weeks could tip the balance toward a clear answer, or make the mystery deeper. Either way, 3I Atlas is one of those rare objects that teaches us something new about the universe.